Hello everybody, this is Mo. This video is gonna be about building a coffee cart. I've never built anything before this, so this was a bit of a challenge, but we got it done. So this video is gonna teach you how to make your own coffee cart for personal use or for business. I'm also gonna be providing some suggestions to take your coffee cart to the next level. So enjoy watching. Starting with the wood, these are the types of wood that we need and the exact measurement to build the coffee cart. Total price of $92.78. Now to build the coffee cart, we need to make a structure, which are the ones that are shown in the video here in the bottom and the top. And then we're gonna attach the plywood that was cut and shaped uh, to that frame. And now we need some paint and hardware stuff to make our cart look pretty. And the total price of everything is At this point, we're done with buying all the stuff that we need to make a regular coffee cart. Everything else after this is optional. So these are the equipments that I personally use to make my own coffee cart. Lighting is very important and having this LED light was very helpful and it's really easy to install. Buying high quality extension cord is really important. This one has a metal surge protector. It's really important that you take something that will protect your highly expensive machines. And now heading to the FlowJet machine. This thing is amazing. It pumps the water from your water bottle to the accumulator. The accumulator acts like a tank and it also gives the water some pressure. So what it does, if we got closer, it will take the water from the water pump and then it will distribute it to two different places. Number one would go to the rinser up here behind the, the garbage. And the second one would go to the espresso machine. The dirty water that comes from the rinser and from the espresso machine ends up in this bucket. I use this coffee cup for personal use, so I only wash this bucket every couple of weeks. This is a custom made garbage. I uh, put it under the knock box so that after I use the coffee grounds, I can just dump it here easily. I bought this hand vacuum to clean up the grinder and it's also perfect to clean up any mess that you have in your coffee cart. 
and this one actually have a good suction. And this is an expandable hose, it's really easy to use. I just hook it up in the kitchen sink and fill up this water bottle instead of carrying that heavy water bottle every single time. Oh, and I almost forgot, this is a water filter system designed specially for um, uh, coffee machines so that you don't have to descale your espresso machines and it also gives your coffee uh, a better taste since you know 98% of coffee is actually made out of water. Um, so you can just use tap water from the bottle and then it will go to that water filter system, it filters it well and then it goes directly to the espresso machine. I got this basket from like the Dollar Tree. It's perfect to organize all of your cleaning equipment. I have like garbage bags, some wipes, and I got all the cleaning stuff that I need to clean up uh, my espresso machine. And right behind this basket, there is a transformer. I use this one because all of my machines are 220, which is European. Uh, so I have to convert it into 110 to use it in the United States. And that's pretty much what I have inside of my cart. You can make whatever you want. You can reorganize this. You can um, add a mini fridge if you want to put your milk inside of it. Uh, you can also uh, put an ice maker if you're offering cold drinks and so on. I decided to build a stand. So this is a sketch of my stand and all the stuff that I needed to, to make this cost me like $130. And these are the measurements for the pipes and for the wood. And at the end, you get this structure.
Here comes the total cost of the whole project. So building the regular coffee cart cost me $270 with everything that I needed and building a stand and getting all the equipment that I wanted cost me $1,200. It comes in total of $1,488, so $1,500 pretty much. Thank you guys so much for watching. I really enjoyed this journey. I hope you enjoyed watching this cool video and good luck with your coffee cart project. And if you have any questions or comments, please put in the comments down below and I'll be happy to answer them for you. Um, and please subscribe to my channel. You can add my Snapchat and this is a Snapchat code. And until the next cool videos, take care.